Hey, here's my PC. Let's open this. All right, first things first. Let's get out the steps. I'm gonna use that later. On top of this box, we got a keyboard right here. Ain't that epic. I already know it's inside. Spoiler alert. Let's go back. Mouse. All the essentials. Now, what I'm gonna do right here, just take out the PC. Watch me go. <laughs> Damn, this does not look safe. Probably won't drop it. Like Alright, so once you get the PC out, you're ready to open it. Take a look at this bad boy. This is the, the coolest part of the process. Right, first thing you gotta do, you gotta unscrew this to take off the cap. You don't have to do this if you just bought it, but uh, here we're just gonna show you the insides and take them apart. Alright, so let's go over the parts in this guy. Here, we have the uh, power supply. And so basically what this does, it changes the uh, volts from the wall and into what can power the motherboard and all the other stuff in there. It connects to the motherboard right down there or something. Probably can't see. Let me flip. Probably can't see it any better, but it connects down there to a switch. I'm not going to take that out because it's annoying to put back in. Uh, but down here, we have the... Um, Here's the heat sink above the motherboard and two bits of RAM. This is eight gigabytes and eight gigabytes, so a total of 16 gigabytes of RAM. Back over here is the hard drive. But the big piece that we want to focus on is this guy right here. This is the GPU. This is what powers all your graphics and your video games and basically it dictates uh, what you need to run games. What I have in my hand right here is the heat sink and that sits right over the CPU, right? GPU. No, I was right the first time. CPU. And so this has thermal paste on it. And I don't really want to take this out right now because it'll get stuff everywhere. So I'm just going to put that right back on there. And it, it connects right here to the power supply. And so all you have to do is go put it on there. Now, if you wanted to, um, yeah, hold on. Now, if you wanted to change out the CPU, I don't really know why you wanted to do that in case you wanted an upgrade or something. But um, if you wanted to, that's how you would access it. You would unscrew the heat sink, and then you would undo that flap that uh, you saw there. Actually, I'm not really, I don't know why I'm screwing it in. All right, but whatever, that's the heat sink. And so what we're going to do now is put everything back in here. After I get this in, I'll start showing you a bunch of other stuff. All right, so once you get the CPU fan back in there, you have to, there's standoffs on the bottom, so you have to take off the back part and screw that in. Once that's done, you can screw back in the CPU fan. Kind of a pain, but let's go through the other stuff that we can put in here. Here are the RAM. This is what you can up, part of the PC that you upgrade, and you should upgrade over time. Right now, it should have 16 gigabytes total with these two. That's all right. All right so now what we're going to do to insert, you got to watch and see which half goes in where. The longer half goes on the longer half side. See, there's a, there's a space right there. All right, let's, I think this side is shorter. So you just line it up, push it in there. And then once you think it's ready, I got it in the wrong way because I'm stupid. Wrong. Maybe I did have it in the right way the first time. There, okay, I did have it right the first time. There's one of them in, and then you just do the same for the second ram that you got. Short side on the short side, you can see in there. Bada bing. Bada. Biz whom. Alright, now to remove them, they got two pins right here. You put, press these down, and on both sides, and the ram will easily come in right now. This is the GPU, the graphics processing unit. So we said before, we just slot this guy in here, move it in. Oh, heck yeah. Smooth as an angel. Then once we have it over the slot, we gently rethink our life decisions. 
and hope we get this right. I don't like that at all. No, that seems right. Oh, it's in there. I didn't break it. Yeah, well, just fix everything right back up. Uh, where did those screws go? Over here. Three small ones. Just bring those back into place. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah! <laughs> oh my gosh. It's been recording for like two minutes. Three. Oh my god, that was awful. Holy smokes. I shouldn't be allowed to touch PCs in the future. Oh, and we got it in there. Sort of. So that's all said and done. Let's plug our things back in. The only thing that we unplugged over here was a. Uh, the the GPU. So let's just slam that back in there. The less graceful you do it, the better. All right, so it's all done now. We um, plugged everything in. All good. Now all we have to do is put the case back on. Grab the case from over here, and let's slide this bad boy on. Go closer. Oh yeah. Screwing it back in. Let's grab this screwdriver. Screws. Do we ever screw in the bottom panel? That's okay. We'll do that in a second. But right, I'll see you when I screw this back in. That's how you do it, baby. All in there. Put the case back on. All good. Just plug it in. Make sure it all lights up. We already did that. I don't want to do it again because I feel like I'm going to blow it up. I'm not. But we're all good. Catch you in the next time, folks. As you can see, this is a while later. I have my setup hooked up. But uh, let's turn this bad boy on. Lights up. This monitor's going to turn on. Let's see. you sign in and set up your Microsoft account, you'll be all in there. I did that in advance, so. Yep, here we go. And that, yeah, that is an FRPG. We did it. Good job, gamers. See you in the next one.